Good morning, my all dear students. As in the previous videos of this chapter, we have discussed the uh, valuation of goodwill by two methods. Today we will discuss the third, fourth, and fifth method. But if you haven't watched the previous videos, you are requested to watch the previous videos of this chapter so that you can clear your doubts and basic information, basic knowledge will be there to with you so that you can understand the upcoming videos. Okay. So let's moving further. Today we will discuss NET method. It's simple. If a firm is making super profit, it is estimated as to how many years firm will continue to get this super profit. Okay. If any firm is getting the super profit, so we have to think that how many years firm will get this type of profit. Okay. So present value of super profit of these years is found out by annuity method annuity table may be consulted for finding out amount of annuity okay formula of goodwill will be super profit into present value of 1 rupee annuity method okay so here is the illustration annual profit after tax this capital employed this normal rate of return this present value this first of all net Profit after tax is seventy-five thousand. The so normal profit less. We have to normal normal profit for getting the super profit. Normal profit is four lakh multiplied by twelve percent. It will be forty-eight thousand. So super profit will be twenty-seven thousand. Okay. The present value of an annuity is one of one rupees is given here. So we have to multiply this by this. So ninety-seven thousand three hundred twenty-nine. It will be our goodwill it will be our goodwill okay next capitalization method average profits are first capitalized on the basis of normal rate of return and then excess of the capitalized amount or net asset of the firm is goodwill in this formula we will calculate the goodwill like this formula is average profit into 100 upon normal percentage of return minus net asset okay chale let's moving further or this one more formula actual profit into 100 upon normal rate of return then net assets will be total assets excluding fixed as a fixed fixed asset minus outside liabilities and goodwill will be value of firm minus net asset okay now here see the illustration number 10 a firm earns rupees 72000 as its average profit the rate of normal return is 12000 The asset of the firm is eight lakh, and the liability is three lakh twenty thousand. Now we have to find out the goodwill. It's very simple. First of all, total value of firm, actual profit into hundred upon normal rate of return, it will be six lakh. Net asset, total asset minus outside liability, so total asset eight lakh minus three lakh twenty thousand, it will be net asset four lakh eighty thousand. Goodwill will be total value of firm minus net asset, it will be one lakh twenty thousand. So this was quite easy. now add uh, just moving to the final method of valuation of goodwill hidden goodwill when new partner doesn't bring amount of goodwill in cash then in such a case firm's goodwill is calculated on the basis of capital of a new partner it will be calculated as a capital of a new partner now here x and y are partners with capital of 16000 and 12000 They admitted Z as a one four share of profit. Z brings sixteen thousand as capital. Now we have to calculate the Z goodwill. Share of firm one by four capital sixteen thousand. So first of all we have to get the one share. One share is equal to four. Either four will be multiplied here sixty four thousand. Combined capital of X and Y and Z sixteen thousand plus twenty two twelve thousand plus sixteen thousand it will be forty four thousand. So goodwill of the firm will be sixty-four thousand minus forty-four thousand twenty thousand. Z shares in goodwill will be twenty thousand into one by four, one is twenty five thousand. So this is it for today's video. In the upcoming video, we will discuss one illustration, one practical problem, complete practical problem, and our this chapter will be completed. Till then. you are uh, you all are requested to keep learning keep studying studying and keep practicing account if you find any type of doubt in any query you can ask 
we will be there our school will be there to help you out in all your needs till then bye bye students